The ADM formalism named for its authors Richard Arnowit, Stanley Dayer and Charles W. Misner is a Hamiltonian formulation of general relativity that plays an important role in canonical quantum gravity and numerical relativity. It was first published in 1959. The comprehensive review of the formalism that the authors published in 1962 has been reprinted in the journal General Relativity and Gravitation, while the original papers can be found in the Archives of Physical Review. Topic. Overview The formalism supposes that spacetime is foliated into a family of spacelike surfaces sigma t display style sigma underscore t labeled by their time coordinate t display style t and with coordinates on each slice given by x i display style x caret i the dynamic variables of this theory are taken to be the metric tensor of three dimensional spatial slices gamma i j T x k display style gamma underscore i j t x caret k and their conjugate momenta pi i j t x k display style pi caret i j t x caret k Using these variables it is possible to define a Hamiltonian, and thereby write the equations of motion for general relativity in the form of Hamilton's equations. In addition to the twelve variables gamma i j displaystyle gamma underscore i j and pi i j displaystyle pi caret i j there are four Lagrange multipliers: the lapse function n, display style n, and components of shift vector field n i, display style n underscore i. These describe how each of the leaves sigma t, display style sigma underscore t, of the foliation of spacetime are welded together. The equations of motion for these variables can be freely specified. This freedom corresponds to the freedom to specify how to lay out the coordinate system in space and time. Topic: Notation. Most references adopt notation in which four-dimensional tensors are written in abstract index notation, and that Greek indices are spacetime indices taking values 0, 1, 2, 3, and Latin indices are spatial indices taking values 1, 2, 3. In the derivation here, a superscript 4 is prepended to quantities that typically have both a three-dimensional and a four-dimensional version, such as the metric tensor for three-dimensional slices. G I J display style G underscore I J and the metric tensor for the full four-dimensional spacetime 4 G mu nu display style caret 4 G underscore mu nu the text here uses Einstein notation in which summation over repeated indices is assumed two types of derivatives are used partial derivatives are denoted either by the operator I display style partial underscore I or by subscripts preceded by a comma covariant derivatives are denoted either by the operator I display style nabla underscore I or by subscripts preceded by a semicolon the absolute value of the determinant of the matrix of metric tensor coefficients is represented by G display style G with no indices, other tensor symbols written without indices represent the trace of the corresponding tensor, such as pi equals g i j pi i j. Display style pi equals g caret i j pi underscore i j. Topic derivation. Topic. Lagrangian formulation 
The starting point for the ADM formulation is the Lagrangian L equals 4 R 4 G Display style math call L equals carrot 4 R S Q R T carrot 4 G which is a product of the square root of the determinant of the four-dimensional metric tensor for the full spacetime and its Ricci scalar. This is the Lagrangian from the Einstein-Hilbert action. The desired outcome of the derivation is to define an embedding of three-dimensional spatial slices in the four-dimensional spacetime. The metric of the three-dimensional slices g i j equals 4 g I J display style G underscore I J equals carrot four G underscore I J will be the generalized coordinates for a Hamiltonian formulation. The conjugate momenta can then be computed as pi I J equals four G four gamma P Q Zero minus G P Q four gamma R S zero G R S G I P G J Q Display style pi caret i j equals s q r t caret four g left caret four gamma underscore p q caret zero g underscore p q caret four gamma underscore r s caret zero g caret r s right g caret ip g caret j q. Using standard techniques and definitions, the symbols four gamma i j zero Display style caret four gamma underscore i j caret zero are Christoffel symbols associated with the metric of the full four-dimensional spacetime. The laps n equals minus four g o o minus one two Display style n equals left caret four g caret o o right caret minus one half and the shift vector n i equals 4 g 0 i display style n underscore i equals caret 4 g underscore 0 i are the remaining elements of the four metric tensor having identified the quantities for the formulation the next step is to rewrite the lagrangian in terms of these variables the new expression for the lagrangian L equals minus G I J T pi I J minus N H minus N I P I minus two I pi I J N J minus one two pi N I plus I N G Display style math call L equals G underscore I J partial underscore T pi carrot I J N H N underscore I P carrot I minus two partial underscore I left pi carrot I J N underscore J F R A C one two pi N carrot I plus Nabla carrot I N S Q R T G right is conveniently written in terms of the two new quantities H equals minus G three R plus G minus one one two pi two minus pi I J pi I J 
Display style h equals sqrt g left caret three r plus g caret minus one left frac one two pi caret two pi caret i j pi underscore i j right right and p i equals minus two pi i j j Display style p caret i equals minus two pi caret i j underscore j, which are known as the Hamiltonian constraint and the momentum constraint, respectively. Note also that the lapse and the shift appear in the Hamiltonian as Lagrange multipliers. Topic: Equations of motion. Although the variables in the Lagrangian represent the metric tensor on three-dimensional spaces embedded in the four-dimensional spacetime, it is possible and desirable to use the usual procedures from Lagrangian mechanics to derive equations of motion that describe the time evolution of both the metric g i j g underscore i j and its conjugate momentum pi i J display style pi caret i j. The result t g i j equals two n g pi i j minus one two pi g i j plus n i j plus n j i display style partial underscore t g underscore i j equals frac 2 n sqrt g left pi underscore i j t frac 1 2 pi g underscore i j right plus n underscore i j plus n underscore j i and T pi i j equals minus n g r i j minus one two r g i j plus n two g G I J Pi M N Pi M N minus one two Pi two minus two N G Pi I N Pi N J minus one two Pi Pi I J minus G I J N minus G I J N N N plus N pi I J N N minus N I N pi N J minus N J N pi N I display style begin aligned partial underscore T pi carrot I J equals an N S Q R T G left R carrot I J T F R A C one two R G carrot I J right plus F R A C N two S Q R T G G carrot I J left pi carrot Minnesota pi underscore Minnesota T F R A C one two pi carrot Two right frac two n sqrt g left pi caret in pi underscore n caret j t frac one two pi pi caret i j right and sqrt g left nabla caret i nabla caret j n g caret i j nabla caret n nabla underscore n n right plus nabla underscore n left pi caret i j n caret n right n caret i underscore n pi caret n j n caret j underscore N pi caret knee end aligned is a nonlinear set of partial differential equations. 
Taking variations with respect to the lapse and shift provide constraint equations h equals zero, display style h equals zero, and p i equals zero, display style p caret i equals zero, and the lapse and shift themselves can be freely specified, reflecting the fact that coordinate systems can be freely specified in both space and time. Topic: Applications. Topic. Application to quantum gravity Using the ADM formulation, it is possible to attempt to construct a quantum theory of gravity in the same way that one constructs the Schrödinger equation corresponding to a given Hamiltonian in quantum mechanics. That is, replace the canonical momenta pi i j t x k Display style pi caret i j t x caret k, and the spatial metric functions by linear functional differential operators g caret i j t x k g i j t x k Display style hat g underscore i j t x caret k maps to g underscore i j t x caret k pi caret i j t x k minus i delta delta g i j t x K display style hat pi caret i j t x caret k maps to i frac delta delta g underscore i j t x caret k. More precisely, the replacing of classical variables by operators is restricted by commutation relations. The hats represents operators in quantum theory. This leads to the Wheeler-DeWitt equation. Topic. Application to numerical solutions of the Einstein equations There are relatively few known exact solutions to the Einstein field equations. In order to find other solutions, there is an active field of study known as numerical relativity in which supercomputers are used to find approximate solutions to the equations. In order to construct such solutions numerically, most researchers start with a formulation of the Einstein equations closely related to the ADM formulation. The most common approaches start with an initial value problem based on the ADM formalism. In Hamiltonian formulations, the basic point is replacement of set of second-order equations by another first-order set of equations. We may get this second set of equations by Hamiltonian formulation in an easy way. Of course this is very useful for numerical physics, because the reduction of order of differential equations must be done, if we want to prepare equations for a computer. <laughs> ADM energy and mass ADM energy is a special way to define the energy in general relativity, which is only applicable to some special geometries of spacetime that asymptotically approach a well-defined metric tensor at infinity, for example a spacetime that asymptotically approaches Minkowski space. The ADM energy in these cases is defined as a function of the deviation of the metric tensor from its prescribed asymptotic form. In other words, the ADM energy is computed as the strength of the gravitational field at infinity. If the required asymptotic form is time independent such as the Minkowski space itself, then it respects the time translational symmetry. Noether's theorem then implies that the ADM energy is conserved. According to general relativity, the conservation law for the total energy does not hold in more general, time-dependent backgrounds, for example, it is completely violated in physical cosmology. Cosmic inflation in particular is able to produce energy and mass from nothing. Because the vacuum energy density is roughly constant, but the volume of the universe grows exponentially. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Application to modified gravity. By using the ADM decomposition and introducing extra auxiliary fields, in 2009, Deruel et al. found a method to find the Gibbons-Hawking-York boundary term for modified gravity theories. 
whose Lagrangian is an arbitrary function of the Riemann tensor. Topic. See also. Canonical coordinates Hamiltonian mechanics Hamilton-Jacobi-Einstein equation Perez metric Topic Notes Topic References Kiefer, Claus 2007 Quantum Gravity Oxford, New York: Oxford University Press ISBN 978-0-19-921252-1